Good morning, YouTubers. Today, I wanted to say, men, or at least I have, decided not to insulate the vehicle. Because to, take, to insulate the vehicle, you have to take the flooring, the panels off, the roof cover, everything, and it destroys the vehicle. A lot of people do insulate their vehicles to keep warm in the winter, in which we have a heater. A lot of people do insulate in the summer to keep their vehicles cooler. However, we have what it takes to keep our vehicle cool. So, the van is insulated. And... We also have portable air conditioners and a fan. So, our dog is very well taken care of. And he has a lot of dog food. So, that's not a worry. We've already discussed and talked to several police officers who have said it's just fine. So that's uh, that's um, that's a matter of opinion to insulate the van. Plus, it takes money, and why would I spend money insulating the van when I need mechanical work done? That's what working backwards is. Why would you take care of insulating your van? when you need mechanical work done, when you need uh, suspension work done. Yeah, you might be warm, but when your van falls apart, you're gonna be stranded out there wherever you're going. So you, it, it, people who don't live van life think they know what they're talking about when they actually don't. If they actually took the time to live in a van or lived outside at all, then they, will, then they will know that every decision that you make is random. Every, just about every decision that you make is random, where you park at. If you want to find a shade spot, if you want to park out in the sun and get solar, if you want to uh, go down the street because uh, you don't have enough gas, uh, every decision you make is random. You can plan for some things, but everybody knows that plans don't always work out. You can plan, plan, and plan, and plan, but usually in plans, something always has a glitch. So, with that being said, If you don't know how it is to live that life, well, and it, another thing, if a person is so worried about the dog being overheated, then send some money to pay for the air conditioner. You're not buying my dog. Send some money to pay for the air conditioner because I'm not selling my dog. There you go, plain and simple. The dog is protection. The dog. Well, it, it doesn't matter what he's for. And he's for my seizures. It doesn't matter what he's for. Uh, if 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 you if you are, if, you're, if you're concerned about the dog being overheated, you want to buy the dog. You live in another state, so there's no way that you can get the dog anyway. So it's pretty much yada yada yada. So anyway, I'm not selling my dog. That's uh, that's what a drug addict does when he doesn't have any crack or any heroin or, or, or something like that. That's what they do. So, if you want to remodel our van, go ahead and send some money to Walmart or to PayPal. That'll work. Until the next time, guys, we love you. God bless.